peace. What's up? Truth about Tupac movement, Tupac Shakur channel worldwide. It's your boy Asher Underwood with the one and only Sean Cole Nusso. What's up, my man? Man, it's good to see you, bro. Oh man, likewise, you too. Man, you have a big history. I mean, a, a deep history and connection to Pac's legacy and what you're doing now and your family and all that. So if we right. could just, for those that don't know about that history, just mm -hmm. tell them a little about who is Sean Cole Nutso, how you came to meet Tupac, why you're relevant to the world of Tupac fans out there. All right. Well, um, to those that don't know, uh, you know, um, government, Sean Cole, you know, uh, stage name or also known as Nutso Outlaw um, or Nutso Outlaw, as all my social sites would say. Um, man, coming around, getting to know Tupac, um, you know, when you listen to, you know, the music before meeting Tupac, it's like you felt like you already know him, like, you know what I'm saying? So for those that didn't that didn't get the chance to meet Tupac, when they hear their music, I'm, I'm pretty sure that they feel the same, that they knew him at one point in time or that they would get to know him and that's how i felt at that time it was like both of them it was like when i was listening to his music i'm like man i know him i know i know him and then it was like man i gotta get down there i gotta get down there you know what i'm saying so um which which kind of you know play a part in that telekinesis type of thing you know what i'm saying so, so going back real quick before you on telekinesis. so <laughs> right, what yeah. so break down ghetto star you know what i mean the ghetto star that came out on um better days album that is the exact original and um if I'm not mistaken, that's the only original song on that album. Mm. So, you know, that's what Tupac really rapped to. That's what we sat down and wrote to, that actual beat. There's a lot of people on YouTube and all these other sites saying, that's not the original version. This is because there's so many remixes out there. So we sitting there writing, and then Pac just, a couple minutes later, Pac just turned to me and said, nuts, man, is this your homie? <laughs> I looked up and said, man, I thought he was with you, man. I came down here with me and, and the, the producer. He said, D you don't know him? I said, I don't know him. I don't know who he is. He said, wait a minute. So he stopped everything. So Tupac was like, wait a minute. You ain't in here with nobody? You don't know nobody in here? And dude was like, I just come to watch the session. Tupac was like, nah, dog, you got to go. And then another thing that people don't know about Ghetto Star, Ghetto Star started off with the title of uh, burying one of our own. So we was writing to the title, burying one of our own to the same beat. And then Pac was like, nah, you know what? We can't do this to that beat. We got to come like, you know, like, like, uh, like. I was like, man, I'm with it. I'm rocking with the punches. Let's roll. Whatever you say, let's do it. I mean, the ghetto star ain't really necessarily a drug. Got to be a drug dealer or a thug, you know what I'm saying, or a gangster or a killer, you know what I'm saying? A ghetto star could be somebody that's that's doing something good for the community, you know what I'm saying? So. Me and uh, my other outlaw brother, uh, Edie, I mean, you know what I'm saying? We we, we doing a, a, a duo album, um, and we calling it Ghetto Star. So, you know what I'm saying? It'll be a, a joint venture outside of some outlaw material, you know what I'm saying? Here we got the movie rolling, about, rolling out. What do you think about the upcoming Tupac biopic? Do you expect to be on there, uh, your character, your, um, you know, scenes that you're a part of? Like, what do you, what do you expect from the movie? That's a good question. Um, Honestly, you know what I'm saying, like over the years it's it's been a lot going on with the Tupac thing and a lot of I control it, a lot of I don't, a lot of he do, a lot of she don't, a lot of she do, a lot of he don't, you know what I'm saying, whatever. Man, what's up with this idea of everyone thinking Pac's still alive? Like how do we rectify those Well, things? you know, that right there, that theory alone right there, I have people be like, oh, wait, wait, did he say that? A blind man in a dead body, I meant to leave town. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when you define, you know. Could please elaborate on the blind man and dead body. That actually well, I ain't gonna is. elaborate. You, said, well, you, I, I ain't you gonna... did say that's one of the deepest lyrics on there. That alone, right there, would, 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 would cause people to be like, "Oh, he's in another country. Oh, he's in Cuba." From that, right there, I think that even in the song that I'm that I'm in with him, you know what I'm saying? People think he was still alive after that. I retired from a life that never gave me shit, but cash that I couldn't spend in countless cars. An addict for a wife, my life that's as a ghetto game. star. Bam. So, you know, we here representing, you know what I'm saying, the truth about Tupac here on the Tupac channel, you know what I'm saying, at YouTube Space LA. So, you know, we representing. I am Nutso, formerly known as Nutso, but fence to be known as Sean Cole, you know what I mean? So we're going to switch that over. And anybody that's following me on the social sites, you know what I'm saying, it's at Nutso Outlaw, N-U-T-T-S-O-O-U-T-L-A-W. Follow that, get with me, I'll follow back. Peace. 
what is he actually promoting by saying that? Nothing. It's just regular conversation. You see what I'm saying? But he's basing his opinion on what he think because now everybody messing with him, you know what I'm saying, and been messing with him for years, you know what I'm saying, and he probably like, man, all right, forget it, man. I, I ain't see Pac die. Ain't nobody who's seen Pac dead. You know what I'm saying? So time will tell everything.